going to believe what just happened. So here I am. Here I am. I just signed up for, I signed up for my second CPR class because I took the wrong one the first time. And guess what? They signed me up under a wrong username. So I did not log in under that username. So I could not take my class. I could not take that course. So I drove 50 minutes again to be told that I can't take this class. This time I couldn't actually go in and take the class. So that's great. I had to call American Red Cross again and reschedule. They reimbursed me so I could reschedule and take the same course under the right username this time. I am just, I'm sick of it. <laughs> oh my God. This is completely, completely a huge like sign that I should not I don't know that I I just I don't know and it's under the same instructor she knows my name by heart now like she knows my name by heart she knows how to spell it now like uh. so I basically drove an hour just to get Starbucks basically so that's what I'm doing I don't know what to order what do I order um and then I'm gonna drive 50 minutes home to tell my boyfriend how much of a failure I am. <sighs> what should I order? I want something good this time. Ice cream cold brew? Do I want ice cream cold brew? Maybe I'll get the salted caramel. I think I'm just gonna get the vanilla sweet cream cold brew. Yeah, I'm gonna get it. I'm going to get the vanilla sweet cream cold brew. So yeah, that's what's going on in my life. I have plans to film and finish my vlog today, I think, or tomorrow. Maybe I'll just do a weekend vlog. But, yeah, I'm going to read today. I need to read my Harry Potter book. That's what's going on. I really need to film a beauty video. Get that uploaded. And I just I just need to start getting my life back on track. But at least tomorrow, on the 26th, I have my TB test. I'm really excited for you. Hey, um, can I get the vanilla sweet cream cold brew? Does that, does that have the um, cold foam on top? Because that would be good. Okay. So I just what is going on with my I need to fix my coloring my filter or whatever I just got done with getting my TB test results I don't have it yay but I did just drive 48 minutes for a two minute um checkup so that's great now I'm going to go to the bookstore and maybe Sephora do I want to do some damage no Yes. No. Yes. No. We'll see. I want to go to Barnes & Noble. So, let's go to Barnes & Noble. It's a 12-minute drive, so...
this is what I have going so far. I'm not sure how I like it. I don't know, I feel like I need to uh, clean off my desk and restart because I just need something new and fresh. But I'm home now, I made dinner, we had spaghetti. I didn't want to record it because every time I record me making dinner, it's always spaghetti. <laughs> we literally, we haven't made it in like over a month, but we basically lived on spaghetti and sandwiches during quarantine when it was rough, like rough. But yeah, made spaghetti, it was really good because I haven't had it in a while. And now I'm just going to end the vlog here, but first I want to do a little book haul because after my TV test results, I went to Barnes & Noble and picked out a few books. I will be doing another like book haul another book related video after this so it's probably going to be repeated but it's fine i decided to buy one of these reusable bags because they're so cute and i'm trying to save the planet you know um and it was only 99 cents so why not i really do need to buy a book case because i have a lot of books now <laughs> so the first book i got is burned this is such an old book. I remember these came out in middle school for me in like 6th or 7th grade. But I never read it, but I'm excited to read it. So I also picked up this book called The Silent Sister. And my one of my best friends just finished this book and she said it was really good. It's like a thriller book and I'm really excited to read it. And then I also picked up the Freddie Mercury Somebody to Love book. And this is about Freddie Mercury and his life and legacy after death being the singer of the band queen you know i love freddie mercury he has been a, a big help for me um the last two years i really do love their his music and i love queen and i love the movie and i just really love hearing about his story because he had a wild life and i just want to get down to the nitty gritty i want to hear all the fun stuff he went to like all the and all the crazy nights he had i'm like so interested in it like just to be able to go back and see how he partied you know the celebrities he met and celebrated with is so cool i really want to i wish i was there at so i could go to studio 54 like that would have been so awesome but yeah i picked this up so i picked those three books up i'm really excited i'm going to do, film a book video tomorrow and yeah so this is going to be the end of the vlog i hope you guys enjoyed watching this video it's probably an up and down crazy video again i will try to tame myself in my next vlog i i need to work on myself i know that i'm not perfect just need to enjoy life the way it is right now and i will get through this because i am strong life is not as hard as it seems in the moment and we all can get through it we all are still living we made it through this pandemic even though it's still going on but we are thriving and yeah thank you guys for watching i hope you enjoyed this crazy vlog let me know in the comments what is your favorite thing you enjoyed this week, whether it was from my video or something from your life. Share, share them with me down below. I would really love to chat with you guys. And yeah, I think that's it. I will see you in my next video. Bye.